Danbury Mint, Doctor Who chess set. The Danbury Mint chess set is now highly collectible. Once you had subscribed, two chess pieces were sent every other month at a cost of £15.45. Expansion sets were also issued covering right up to the TV movie with Paul McGann. Enclosed within the pack would have been uh, this cover information from the original promotional leaflet. Uh, this has not been available for some time and I'll put pictures up in a second. Ever since the very first episode was shown in November 1963, the Doctor's breathtaking adventures have enthralled viewers for three decades. Aided by his heroic companions, his crusade against the most evil forces in the universe have become legendary. Now, for the first time ever, those fabulous characters were brought together in a, new, in a unique Doctor Who chess set. Brilliantly represented in solid pewter, this superb collection recreates the epic battles between good and evil. Each character in this superb set was expertly recreated in solid English pewter. The detail in each sculpture was magnificent. Uh, each piece of is an object of art in its own right. Uh, this is truly a chess set to enjoy, both as a game and as, as a piece of artwork. To complement your chess set, you would receive a handsome playing board at no extra cost, crafted from carefully selected woods. This also contains each of the 38 pieces and its own lined compartment for protection. In addition, every subscriber This is the ultimate accessory for any serious Doctor Who fan. If you want to own a Danbury Mint Doctor Who chess set, um, you simply won't find better than this. The playing board is in superb condition when made and all original 38 handcrafted pewter pieces are included. Each one is in excellent and original condition and the set consists of the following pieces. You, on, the white, on the white side, which is the good side, for the king you choose the playing piece from the first of the seven doctors, William Hartnell, Patrick Troughton, John Purby, Tom Baker, Peter Savid Davison, Colin Baker and Sylvester McCoy. All seven doctors are of course included. Now, the queen is obviously Leela, the bishops are Chameleon and the Brigadier, the knights are Jamie McCrimmon and Adric. Rooks, of course there are two, are the two TARDIS models. And you have eight models of K9 which represent the pawns. On the black side, the king is the master. You have the queen, which is the Rani. You have the bishops, which are Cyberman and a Draconian. Uh, for the knights, you have the Ice Warrior and the Sea Devil. Uh, for the rooks, you have two models of the Sontarans, and you have eight models of the Daleks, uh, which are the Dark Side um, pawns. Now, there was also a second wave of chess pieces consisting of 24 figures which were available, which were uh, two masters uh, TARDISes, which were the grandfather clocks. You had two of those for uh, baddies. You also had two robots of death, which were the rooks. You also had Davros, Omega, Morbius, and Sharon's Jack as bishops. And then you had a Silurian, Zygon, Yeti, Terraleptil as knights. And for the goodies, you had Castellan, Sergeant Benton, Captain Yates, and Alpha Centauri as uh, bishops. You had Harry Sullivan and Turlow as knights. And you had Zoe, uh, Susan and Perry, Joe, Grant, Tegan, and Ace also. Um, 100% sure what all of those uh, pieces were but again they were uh, available at some point and also as I recall in 1996 to commemorate the release of the 1996 TV movie there was also uh, Paul McGann as a Doctor Who King and obviously uh, the Queen was Daphne Ashbrook and, and for the dark side, you had uh, the master, Eric Roberts. And obviously during this time, uh, there was also a uh, three-tier 
black enamel uh, gloss TARDIS made available for all 38 pieces and two waves of uh, chess pieces which was made available through Danbury Mint via mail order so I hope you enjoy, enjoyed this full presentation of uh, the Doctor Who chess set which again just to reiterate was released by Danbury Mint back in uh, 1992 so I will see you all on the next few videos sorry I haven't done that much uh, Doctor Who in a while it's very hard to find content that is original um, so please show your appreciation for this video and I will see you all on the next Doctor Who merch thank you now bye bye <laughs>